right? So this is a defense. And why you need to do defense is because sometimes you can't avoid, you're too deep, and avoiding is not uh, useful. So even though you avoid, you can still get hit. So a uh, few principles of uh, defense. One is quick move. Secondly, displace and replace. So why is displace and replace? Displace means you move your body away from the incoming attack to create some space between you and the blade. And replace, meaning you replace where your body was with a blade. So it blocks in the full attack. All right? So normally with uh, four walls drills, we we'll use two hands to block strong attacks, but uh, generally when we go, one hand is sufficient for a block. Right? Of course, against uh, much stronger follow through attacks with, or heavier weapons, you might need to use two hands to prevent your hand from block, uh, hitting yourself like this. All right? So, uh, first drill we're going to do is uh, basically learning how to displace and replace from every single position. All right? So, what you do is one, uh, one person is a defender, one person is an attacker. So, in this case, Nia will be an attacker. Alright, so at first we'll both start from a 1 position and she's going to give me a 1 strike. Alright, and at this point I will displace myself, which is this way, and replace. So I'll punch out the blade, block the attack. Alright, reset. I'll stay on 1, but she goes to the next chamber, which is 2. And she'll give me a 2, I'll displace, and replace. Alright, so again, now I'm on 1 and she's on 3, so displace. Replace and now I'm one and she's on four. So replace, replace. Okay. Once that set is completed, you move on to chamber number two and she cycles through one, two, three, four chambers. So displace, replace, displace, replace, displace, replace, and replace, replace. Alright? So uh, just practice through all the chambers and all the combinations. There are 16 in total. Alright? So uh, you'll find that some ways are easier to actually defend against uh, and some are more awkward. But as long as you adhere to the principles of displace and replace as well as quick movement as quick as possible to intercept the incoming attack, you should be fine. Alright? Next drill that we do is actually a close eye drill. So this is to simulate the sudden uh, attack that you might have to react to. So it's a reaction training. So I'll start off with one chamber and I'll close my eyes. Alright? And Nia will move to any chamber she wants. And when she's ready, she'll say open eye. Open. Open. So that I'll open, I'll immediately see where the blade is. And she waits for my eyes to open and when my eyes open, she will start the attack. So now I have to register the attack and do the appropriate block. Alright, so you do it for a while on one chamber, so I close. Open. And immediately come out. So uh, when you're practicing with a partner, try to go for actual strikes. So if you do this, this is not going to hit. So you need to be closer. So if you don't move, it will actually hit. Alright, so this is where your defense really comes in. Okay, but partner, do not strike hard, start slow, register the incoming strike, and then uh, you can progress faster, but do stop and control. Alright? Let your uh, partner actually block. Alright? Do not block too early. Do not let him block too early. So for example, if I am uh, I am attacking, alright? And you are blocking. So I'm going to do one. And now you defend. So this position is not ideal, okay? So you want to ideally come in close and then stop here. Do not stop here because it's hard to block when you're stopped here, all right? It's good to block when you're here so you get a nice block, but it's not so easy when you are here, all right? So once you're comfortable with the one position, you go to the two position and repeat again, all right? And that's all the jokes that we have. Alright, thanks.